who believes in man-made climate change? Man-made climate change? Yeah. It ain't, it ain't <laughs> happening. <laughs> it ain't happening. I, yeah. we, we, we ain't buying it. I don't buy that. You don't buy it? No. No. Anyone here? No. 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 A storm of biblical proportions. Another deluge of torrential rain on this tiny island. But the inhabitants fear that in the end, nature may not spare them. Welcome to Tangier. Morning. Hey, morning. You're taking on a lot of water. Looks like your boat's been through a few storms. Yeah. The morning after the storm, and water, water everywhere. Navigating the rain-sodden streets on this island of 450 souls can be treacherous. The main mode of transport here, golf buggies. For some time now, this sinking, shrinking island has been in peril. Since the 1850s, the land mass of Tangier has shrunk by two-thirds, submerged under the waves. Recently, scientists who visited this subsiding community suggested its inhabitants may become America's first climate change refugees due to rising sea levels and storm surge-induced erosion. So how long have these islanders got left unless drastic action is taken? Some scientists say it could be 50 years, others as little as 20. But people here worry every day about every major storm and standing here, or rather sinking, into this front garden. You can understand why. And this storm hardly registered. It's hurricane season. Worse is to come. This is where we put the blue crab, the peel crabs, and wait for them to molt or shed. This is the man the islanders hope the will bring them and, salvation. Uh, these will be shipped out. Tomorrow they'll be on somebody's table for dinner. The mayor, known to everyone as Uka, is one of Tangier's watermen. Male and female. Making his living for the much prized soft shell crabs. He was hoping it was a finger. <laughs> Uka took me out into the choppy waves of Chesapeake Bay, a body of water which sustains the island's livelihood, indeed, its whole way of life, yet now threatens it. The cross you see here on this island, actually, I put that there last year. That was not an island, it was a peninsula. So you put the cross here last year? Yeah. And that was land, that was yep. land all the way, yep. Yep. from was, that area all yep. the way across? That was on a, and it's all gone? It's all gone. All, like, all this area here disappeared last year. Tangier is in serious trouble, but Uka fiercely dismisses any link to man-made climate change. He's adamant the sea levels are not rising. I just can't see a difference in the sea level from what it was when I was a small boy to now. Yet the sea is swanning up this land. Yeah. Well, so uh, how can it's, that it's, be? Just, it's just natural wave action. It's just natural wave action caused by the wind. If the scientists are saying the sea levels are rising, right. this is due to climate change, but you have a different conclusion. One of you must be right and one of you must be wrong. I just don't see it. I don't see it with my own eyes. I don't see it. There's another man who they also hail as their potential savior. Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Uh, Always Trump. Trump. 2020. Nearly 90% of Tangier's voters backed Trump in 2016. His name's everywhere. The re-election posters are already up. They really love Trump here, and he showed them some love back. I was actually out crabbing. It was a Monday morning, and my son and another guy came out to me and said, you need to get home immediately. The president's going to give you a call. He wants to talk to you. Were you surprised? Yeah, I, th I thought it was a joke. I said, yeah, president, what, president of what or who? President Trump was on the line to share his views on climate change. What did he ask you? He said, oh, you know, the sea level rise, uh, we're on the same page with that. But did he say to you he doesn't believe in man-made climate change? We talk briefly about climate change. Whenever there's a change in the weather or climate, I believe it's just natural changes, cycles, and... Uh, and what did President Trump say? He said, yeah, he said, that's what, I, that's what I think also. Tangier is a conservative, deeply Christian community, 
where alcohol is banned. Welcome to the Situation Room. So every uh, afternoon, Mitchell it's not Shores, a pub where the island's elders gather, Bobby Crockett, but here, Alan Crockett. these men are descendants of 17th century Cornish settlers, uh, and some accents yeah. are as thick as clotted cream. It don't get to me, old, we ain't going to be in a while, I don't think. But that's all I don't know anything about. But their message is clear. They don't all trust the science. Scientists? Yes, scientists also say we uh, evolved from apes too. It's biblical. It's biblical. Yes, indeed. It sure is. If the erosion continues like it is... And the island's going to vanish. Uh, part of it will. Part not of all it will, of it, but yeah, part definitely. of it will. Mm. Yeah. And it's not because of sinking. They want a multi-million dollar seawall built to hold back the waves and protect their land. If we get a seawall, I don't care if ISIS uh, supports us and puts a seawall around here. Any, put any name you want on it, just so we get the seawall. On the west side of the island, a breakwater has been cobbled together. These are the people. It's at the we back the of Donna Crockett's place. She says it's working, but they urgently need a much bigger wall built. And quick, God willing. And I believe our faith in God. I believe his will is for us to survive. So if it's God's will, why has God allowed all this erosion to happen? Put people's futures in, in danger? Well, Trump called. Look at all the attention that's coming. People are coming here seeing the reality of the island. They're seeing how beautiful it is. I don't believe God allows anything like that. I don't believe he wants bad for us, but I do believe that maybe this attention, maybe it'll help. So what's the future for these little American heroes, the next generation of watermen? Will they have an island to grow up on? As this family headed home, the storm clouds close in once again. They may not agree on why, but time is running out for Tangier.